Hello everyone, I received a package from Scott and uh, it says here that this should include two 12 inch records, three 7 inch records and two CDs. Now uh, I should know uh, one of the 12 inch records, uh, I'm pretty certain about uh, two of the 7 inches and I'm also guessing that I know one of the CDs, but let's see what's in here. The first one is a CD, okay not what this is not what I was expecting. This is Fear Not for the Wounded Heart. Uh, don't know anything about this band uh, other than what I've seen uh, Scott show this in his videos. This is a Rocks Records release from this year. Uh, based on the sleeve, this looks to be like a 90s metal or uh, hard rock, something like that. And it looks to be a five song EP. Yeah, uh, I'm curious to hear about that one. Okay, next one. Okay, yeah, um, uh, not what I was expecting this one either. This is Angel, Live Without a Net. Uh, it's, oh, it looks to be a Japanese pressing. And this is from 1980. Uh, yeah, uh, I have been interested in in this band, but I haven't I haven't heard actually anything about anything from this band, uh, and I actually requested uh, another album uh, by Angel from Scott, and the other album should be included here. So this one was a, a, a big big surprise. Really looking forward to hearing that one. Okay, and yeah, this was one of the singles that I was. Uh, uh, guessing that would be here. This is Sleeping Back by CZ Top, um, which is from the Afterburner. And the other side is uh, Party on a Patio, uh, which is from the El Loco album. Okay, and next one. Yeah, again, uh, this was the other one that I was pretty certain that would be included here. Uh, stages, again, from the Afterburner album. Uh, the Afterburner album itself is uh, one of my least favorite, uh, if not the least favorite album of CC Top that I have heard. There's, uh, I think, uh, two of the uh, three of the albums that I haven't heard at all. Uh, but the, the song Stages itself is uh, among my very favorite CC Top songs. Uh, what is the B side here? It's uh, Can't Stop Rocking. Yeah, okay. And then. Ah, yeah, okay. I, I didn't remember, but he did actually mention that he was sending this one to me. Uh, this is Gary Moore, After the War, um, back with uh, this thing called Love, and this looks to be a gatefold sleeve. Again, After the War is uh, among my least favorite uh, Gary Moore albums, uh, although there are several Gary Moore albums that I haven't heard, but of the ones that I have heard, this is one of my least favorite albums. Uh, but I do collect Gary Moore singles, so this one is very uh, welcomed in, into my collection. Okay, well, let's see about the albums. Ah, okay, yeah, he was uh, hinting uh, that he might send something from this. This is uh, Helix, uh, Walking the Razor's Edge, which is from uh, 1984. Yeah. Uh, Ah, okay, so this seems to be the album which includes the song Six Strings, Nine Lives, which one of the uh, members of the VC is very familiar with. Uh, I only uh, have one one-sided uh, promo single from uh, Helix, which is a power ballad, so I'm guessing that song is not a good uh, song to base your opinion on this band. Uh, I'm expecting this one to be a much more heavier band than that one song is. So yeah, very, very curious to hear this album. And yeah, finally there's the one that I was expecting. Uh, this is the one that I was uh, I requested from Scott and he did find one for me. This is Angel, hell of a band. Uh, I have been interested in this band for a long time and I wanted to start getting to know this band from the start. Uh, I believe this is their first album. Uh, this is one album that I don't see here. 
Uh, I do see the album which has a, a all white background and one that has a, a blue background. Uh, those two I do see here at least from time to time, but not this one. Uh, let's see what's this ad here is. Ah, okay, so this one mentions For the Wounded Heart is the reunion EP for Fear Not and their first new music since 1993. So uh, I was correct that they are a 90s band. Uh, this album here, by the way, is one that I'm going to be ordering from you. But yeah, uh, I, like I said, I haven't heard anything from uh, from Angel, so I'm guessing that they are uh, a late 70s, early 80s uh, hard rock band. Uh, this one is on uh, Casablanca label, and it looks to be from 1976. So yeah, this is again a, a bit earlier than what I was thinking. But yeah, very much looking forward to hearing this one. Um, yeah. When I went to pick, this, uh, pick up this uh, package from the ma uh, post office, uh, I mailed my package to Scott at the same time. And Scott knows what's uh, included in that package. So let's hope that it reaches you in perfect, co perfect condition. Uh, that's it for this time. Hope you like this. Thanks for watching. Leave a comment. Bye.